Hi there, everybody. Welcome back to Oxygen Not Included here on our DC Colony. All right, so <clears throat> we've reached a point on the game to where things take a while. And I don't want to, I mean, I want you guys to see what I'm building and all of that good stuff. But at the same time, I don't want to just sit here and, like, make it look like we're not doing anything, right? <laughs> so I have some thoughts. Remove that. <clears throat> One of the thoughts is, um, not this episode, but maybe starting next episode, um, I will progress. Meaning, I'm going to say, for example... Um, I'll come in and say, all right, today we're going to do da 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 I'm going to build out all of this and then talk about it a little bit, map things out, and then transition, and it's all built. And a couple cycles have gone by. I don't know. I'm trying to think of ways that I can do that. The other thing is, is that I want to get to these other planets <coughs> and do new stuff. Now, the Sonar machine I've never done before, so that's why I'm focusing on this and I'm making the effort to do it here but uh, I want to transition to a point to where um, you know we can get it um, set up oh yeah I need to bring over thimble reed seeds um, <clears throat> I should make sure I do that get to the point to where I can do the other things, and I'm not just always here on Earthino, and always on Spironi, and always on Unbendista. Now, of course, once Unbendista is done, <coughs> unless something goes wrong, I should never have to go look at it. But <laughs> you never know how things are going, right? Um, all right, so we need to come in here. We need thimble reed seeds. Um, probably the fastest way to look for. Bimble reed seeds is to come over here. Because who knows? I've put them somewhere. I have zero units. That presents a problem. That presents a big problem. Which basically need, means I need a drop. Smironi? Probably not. Um, but, um... And, and this didn't, right? That's that's right. That's why I fed them all to the fishes way back early in the game. And that's why I put together on Earthino the farm here. Because I never thought I would need the farm. Oh, yes. wonderful plan of independent independence over there is uh, now hamstringed until I find thimble reed seeds. Now the question is No. Now Gupato may Gupato has thimble reed seeds. Well, I've delivered steel here which means I can build my thing. We might be going to Gupato. Gupato's here. <clears throat> so we might be preparing to go to Gupato to do a pod. Uh, which pods do I got on my rockets right now? I have a rover, which we still need. I have this. Let's deconstruct this one. And we'll put in a, a thing. Do you have something in you? 
No, okay. Oh yeah, we launched our rocket. <laughs> you don't have thimble reed seeds, do you? <laughs> Probably not. We're not going to get anything super awesome from this place. But it's our first test of the drill cone. I mean, eventually what I need to do is go to... This one wouldn't be bad to have a regular one, too. <clears throat> I haven't looked at all of these, but now that we've explored some of them, might as well take a look. Molten Tungsten. This is the new planet, which we haven't <coughs> really looked at. I have no idea what's on Dystonia besides Regolith. <coughs> Rust would make sense. Aha! Maybe there's salt and stuff. Um, anyways, back to star map. This is the Temporal Tear, which is going to be interesting to get to. We got Russell's Teapot, which eventually we'll, we'll go get because... We don't want Russell to be without his teapot. That's... Okay, so this one's the important one I want to get to because it has the fullerene. <coughs> Solid methane? Huh. What do you do with methane? I must be from the moo moo thing. So here's more fullerene. Yeah, so th so th these are currently these are the two that I really want to get to is the fullerene, <coughs> which ideally we'd set up a launch platform on one of these others to come get the stuff and then have a transport rocket back and forth. Maybe I don't know. <clears throat> so we've got a couple things still to explore once we get rockets out here and there. Hmm, interesting. All right, well we'll we'll get there. Don't worry. All right. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, I'm going to get a drink. Are we refilling? We are. Okay, so you're going to be full in a moment. Um, so we might as well go ahead and bring this up. So I'm going to say for now because we got a bunch of workers over there. I'm going to do that. We're going to go ahead and get you full and get you launched back to Smiron, uh, Abundista because we're down to 64,000 cows. <coughs> Mostly because it's going bad. I might want to really focus <coughs> on the kitchen here. Um, let's get some more things set up so that we can just get things done, right? Um, let's go ahead and do this stretch here all the way through. Yep, yep, yep. <clears throat> let's go ahead and get this out done as well. And then these. Um, get, let's get our power grid in place. Yeah, we'll get the power grid in place. And our gas pipes uh, here in place. <coughs> this is... <coughs> Excuse me, sorry. going to be the cooling system for our food, so I'll get that set up as well. It's not active. It's over here. We haven't built it yet. Um, so we'll get that set up too. So we'll work on those. We need to work on that and then get this piping done so that we're good um this is for the bathroom setup so yeah you guys are they're moving quite quickly with getting things done so we might as well just tag it along continue to get things taken care of um got to build this before that we could take these down and we're going to need a couple unfortunates. We're going to need a couple ladders just to reach this ceiling section here. The 
let's get these floor pieces done because otherwise that's where you risk getting someone stuck. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. So we'll do that. You guys continue to work. Let's come back to Earthino and check out our hopper. We should be full of food, right? We got 142,000 calories, so we'll get a little bit more in a moment. Um, most of it is fresh. Some of it is stale. <laughs> That's where we need to get things taken care of over here on our colony. All right, so we got all of these taken care of. We've, we're fully fueled here. We're not, not going to do anything with this right now, but we'll do that, and we'll bring this down. We're not making oxalate right now, so we can't refuel this. <laughs> and there's no immediate need, but we'll do it in a moment. Well, not really a moment, but you know what I mean. <laughs> So that'll get this going. What are you full of? You're full of diamond for the drill ship, so... You know, there's nothing we can do about that. That's always going to take damage. That's kind of sucky, even though it's built out of steel. Alright. <clears throat> Let's come down here and see. Did we get this up and running? We did. We just need to get this reset. So if it is above... 15... You can stay on. Probably means they're going to stay on most of the time, but that's okay. Anyways, that gets this going again. Not that it was a big deal, but it's good to get it going so that we can flow all that. Um, I have learned so much on this colony. You know, I've got my other episodes of Olympus where I'm applying everything I've learned, including feedback that I've really appreciated across the past even if I don't always apply the feedback. <laughs> I know it's frustrating, probably for the ones that are giving it, because it's like, oh man, he doesn't listen, he doesn't learn. <laughs> he believes inaccurate stuff, <laughs> which isn't true. <clears throat> How are you guys doing here? Um, where's our athletics? You're at athletics one, you started zero. Oh, no, no on the wrong thing. <laughs> You're Athletics 4 already. <clears throat> you started at 2. And Sleeper 1 is at Athletics 4 as well. So, Alright, cool. Well, we'll keep you guys going. Alright, Hopper, are you full? Okay, Hopper is full. Let's go ahead and launch the Hopper and send our food resources back. And well, it's, you know, Aquaman will be able to help do extra building over there so let's go ahead and do that begin launch sequence there we go <clears throat> all right and then let's check here you are mining look at that awesome awesome so he's drilling he's using up his stuff does it say what you're picking up i mean this is what you're mining and whatnot but <clears throat> It says the cargo bay is filling. It just doesn't show me what. Can I... No, if I pick on it, it probably doesn't tell me anything. Where's the Driller? Yeah, th this doesn't show me anything <laughs> from here. We're out of power! So you can't entertain yourself, huh? Well, you have zero stress, so I guess you're okay. <laughs> Um, so speaking of um, these ships, we need to get our oxalite production back in place. Um, so I want to put it up near here so that we're not doing stuff. So let me see. What is it? It's refinement, right? All right. So let's get our oxalite refinery. Um, so I just want to set it up closer um, also to where the power grids are. Don't want to put it out in space. There's that. We might take this. Yeah, we'll probably do that to, to help um, set stuff up. But we can do it here. So we'll do that. We'll get our shipping. We had the nice big influx from our Abundista volcanoes. So that's awesome. <coughs> 
Okay, we'll go ahead and set this up. I don't want to drill through, or remove that tile, though. Let's just switch it over. We can just do this. Okay, we're going to set you there. <clears throat> now, that means we need our rail. This is where we're short on resources still, unfortunately. Um, so we can go through here. Now, this was the original oxalite line, right? Let's look. <laughs> yes. This is the original oxalite line. <clears throat> and we've got to separate the oxalite and the diamond because we've clogged up the diamond. Um, <clears throat> so, yeah. What I think I'll do is I'll just come up through here and we'll do a new oxalite line through here. That is the oxide line. And then I'll take the diamond stuff out of it. And I also... <clears throat> I'm learning. We'll have to move that other valve. But if we do this, it will protect the oxalite from off-gassing until it gets up into here. Right. All right. Now that means we need to put in our oxalite station here. Basically, we you know, it's going to be a conveyor receptacle that goes here, and it's only going to turn it on once when it senses a rocket and blah, 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 blah. <clears throat> so we'll do that, um, and we'll plan that. Now this, what is this one made out of? Gold? Okay, so it doesn't, <coughs> the, <coughs> excuse me, the conveyor line is not melting out here, so that's okay. <coughs> excuse me. But I want to shut off valve in here. Does it have to be, darn it. Yeah, well, that quite won't work. Because I'd have to put it here or whatever to get it to work. Or stick it down here on each rocket item. Oh, we can do it. See, what I'm thinking, I haven't looked up any ideas, but if I was to do this... Like that. <clears throat> this one will melt. So I have to build it out of steel, unfortunately. <clears throat> but if I was to do that, could I? <clears throat> I would put an automation wire. Oh, this thing doesn't have automation. How would I do it? I need a sensor, so I do it. Do it from here. Yeah. So only when the rocket is here will it send, and I probably only want to send it on a timer. Otherwise, it'll just keep keep it on. Yeah. I don't know if I need to do this, but if I went like this. I would need a timer as well, right? Creates a timer to send green signals for specific amounts of time. Well, I would want... <clears throat> Just looking here really quick. I would want it to say, hey, if this is green, 
then activate the timer, which then... Hmm. Because I have a... F what are you... So, if a rocket is present... And the timer is... Well, maybe we should just... How about we make it... Even simpler than this. I mean, I know the whole idea is, is that... Well, you know, let's try to make it... So that, you know, you can just automate it. But let's start with this. To where we can just turn it on when we want to fill it and we turn it off. Right? That's the simple way to do it. Let's not complicate it. What do we got in here? Conveyor routes, oxalate. Yeah, we've got some oxalate. We've got also... Oh, this one's... We have two oxalates in here. This is all diamond. Yeah, so we're going to concentrate here first. <coughs> All right, so that probably means... No, 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 this is fine, this is fine. All right. It's okay to store the oxalate in here, because it's sealed, it can't off-gas. That's right. Now, here's the tricky part. We need... Ah, yes. I need to deconstruct this one here. So I could put the the sensor in. And then we're going to need a power wire that uh, comes up here. It met the, eh, don't want to make it out of gold, but I'm going to have to make it out of gold. I mean, steel. Otherwise, I think it's going to melt. All right. Do that. And now we set that up. Alright, there we go. Okay, that's the oxalate. This is that. I want to take this across because I can recover. Well, no, we, we're short on these metals. What we're not short on is this stuff. <coughs> There we go. All right, cool. So let's go ahead and get all of this set up. Did I not launch you? Cancel launch, what are we waiting for? Who, who do I have as pilot? Aquaman? How come you haven't launched yet? says it's loading the crew. We've been sitting here for a long, long, long time, though. Where's Aquaman? Aquaman, where are you going? No? Dead, tired, snoring friend. Well, where you need to go, Aquaman. Is up... Oh, wait. Is it because... He's waiting on a suit. Yeah. How come we have no suits? Right. <clears throat> um. What volcanoes do we have on a Medista? <laughs> I'm forgetting. We have a copper one. We'll use the copper.
Alright, Aquaman, you need to you need to go get in a rocket. Because otherwise a Bundista Well, it should be fine in a Bundista, but it's it's gonna present some problems. Read fiber seed? No. <laughs> I was hoping, fingers crossed, you know. Who do we got? Light to receive. Small bladder. Probably would want you, wouldn't we? Um, Alright. Arthino. Sleeper number four. It's gonna be you, Max. Sleeper four. Alright. Okay. Sleeper four. Very good. Make sure you're good. Where are you at? <clears throat> Priorities, sleeper four. Operating. <laughs> All right. Well, hopefully Aquaman will come and get in his rocket. But what I think the problem is, is he's he's waiting for a suit. Now it says that they're all. Maybe we should just here. Let's just do this. We've got suits here. If we do this, will it force? I mean, we've got the suits, so let's just force it and get them all filled with oxygen. Maybe that's what the issue is, is that Aquaman's going, Hey, I can't go anywhere because there's no suits. Because we've been taking them on rockets all this time. And so therefore, um, you know, we haven't had time. You know what? That could explain why everybody's just sitting here in the base doing basic stuff. Because every time we take a rocket, you know, these don't replenish. They just become empty again. There we go. Alright, well maybe that got Aquaman out of there. It did. He launched. Okay. <laughs> that solved that problem then. Okay, well, you guys are doing that. Now we got people that can come out and do all of this. So that's good. So we can uh, progress. Ha <laughs> ha! And then in a, bustista, a, blah, 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 a bandista, we're ready to do some more um, priority building. We're still working on stuff, but... I think we can go ahead and add in a few more items. So we'll do that. But let's uh, let's start separating out these rooms. We'll do the bathroom, and we'll do the kitchen, so we can store our food, if nothing else. Alright. So that means over here, I can put that in, too. Okay, cool. <clears throat> Alright, excellent, excellent. Uh, we'll copy our settings here for our food production. What's our temperature? 33. I think it's slightly higher than what I'm going to want, right? Um, because if I come over here, temperature three, 35 to, yeah, so we'll have to get our temperature down, but we've got a cooling system and a cooling loop in place for that, so we'll get that. <clears throat> but let's try to get all of that in place, so we'll do that. Let's get our cooling loop in place um yeah so that should be all of the cooling loop and then get that in place <laughs> 
<clears throat> cool. So we got that. We got that. This needs sand. Filtration medium. So we'll start filling that up. <clears throat> we won't put anything in here yet. But if we can get the kitchen set up, we can store food over here. So that'll be really good. All right. Excelente. Uh, Power-wise, we can get our next thing here set. And we can get this deconstructed so that we can hook up those power lines. That's already hooked up. This one will be done soon. We can deconstruct this one, and we can deconstruct that one. And we can get our power here and put this in place. Maybe, there we go. Okay, that'll give us power to everything inside the base once the wiring's hooked or connected. So that's good. Let's try to get this part done so that it's all taken care of up on the floor. All right, so here's our rocket. Let's come in here and dump our food out. Okay, and then let's get a quick sweepage on a number nine. Excellent. All right, and then over here, you guys are getting all of this done. All right, so this is going to be oxalite. Do, 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 do. It should be under subliminators now. There we go. Excellent. Uh, we'll go ahead and set this on a red for now, but it is hooked up. We need power to it. Well, that shouldn't be a problem. We got a line, a line right there. Cool. Excellent. So if I'm going to eventually rebuild a kitchen, <clears throat> I got to think of how I want to do all of this. See, we're putting in all of this stuff. Um, I'm going to need a path that goes up and down, but I also want to go ahead and put in some some goodies and some stuff. So, yeah, I'm not quite sure how to do that, but I would need to move this. I think this is going to be in the way. And then... Hmm. We would need... A spot to where we can put in our suits and we can go out of the base and we also need a spot where we can come across through here now for this part what I'm thinking is that I could put in a transit tube Because we've got plenty of plastic, right? Because I could put in a transit tube that goes straight across and connects our bases, or elements of our bases, so that we don't need to go in and out just to... We don't need to go out of the base just to get to one of the farms and whatnot. We can just come across and whatnot. Um... That could be pretty cool. Because uh, what I'm thinking is since we have... It's either I connect all of this and I make it like this part as all part of the base. And then on this side, I make all of this part of this base. And then in the center, I have my main up and down access to, to go... And so I would have some some suit docks 
some suit docks, and then technically I'd be able to open all of this up to be included in part of the base. Get rid of this because it could be in the middle. I'd still want to do maybe some of this stuff, but right now we don't have to do it. Yeah, because that would be the wrong place for it. If we end up connecting this as part of the base, then I won't need <coughs> that. So what I think I'm going to do Ben is this will mean this is the main spire. We'll keep it. And what we'll do is we'll start putting together a wall through here. <laughs> and then we would want to do the same thing. So this is going to be, I think, where I put my suits. So, in fact, I'm going to cancel this. And cancel this. So, because what I think I'm going to be doing is, since this is going to be the outside wall, you see, we can get across there. So, we'll just we'll do this all the way down on this top section. All right. And then we're going to do the same thing over here. There's going to be a wall first. That's going to be here. But this will be the exit. Which means we're going to do this. Not that I have to have this granite wall on the inside, but we're going to do it anyways. Why? Because I'm stubborn. Like that. So, technically, we should have raised this up higher, but it's okay. We are good. Alright, and then this is going to have a door that's going to be here. We don't need it out of gold, though. We can make it out of cobalt. A door, because what we're going to end up doing... <laughs> Where's our stations? Is we're going to be putting in Atmo suit docks. Here and here to get out of the base to go up to the rockets or to zip down. Very good. So I'm just going to mark that, which means we're going to need to move this and set things up a little bit differently. You know, we're going to come over here, we can use gold. Uh, we're going to say, hey, there's going to be a power thing here. There's going to be a power thing here. We're going to move this one. That one's going to have to go down. Um, we might as well do it now. Uh, let's go ahead and deconstruct it. And deconstruct these tiles. Very good. And then deconstruct the heavy watt wire. Very good. And we'll deconstruct these two because we're gonna we're gonna change this stuff around. Alright. <clears throat> At least now we have lots of regular metals. It's just the steel we're short on. Come on, you can do it. Okay, so there's that. Boom. Boom. That gives us three power converters into this area here. That's going to take the place of some of this stuff. So we can remove it out. Very good. Hmm. <coughs> I'm going to go ahead and put the kitchen right here at the top. So let's plan that. That means I want a metal tile that's very conductive. Let's, let me see. This is going to be the fish place. That's where we're going to put our eggs. Um, and then I want to take the meat 
and put it into a place where we have the meat. Realize we're at 40 minutes. We're going to pause the episode and come into the next episode. Or this, I'm just so busy doing stuff that I'm not paying attention and whatnot. Um, how's our star map? Are you full? You are full. Yeah, so we need to send you back before we run out of food and stuff. <laughs> All right. Um, change destination. There we go. Let's get you landed. <laughs> Forgot about the ship up there as well. All right, we'll come back <coughs> in the next episode and continue um, a bunch of stuff. So <laughs> I kind of got carried away a little bit um, with some with you know getting getting stuff done and whatnot. And so you know we need to take a step back <laughs> and get get some things done so <laughs> all right see you in the next episode everybody take care <laughs>